got to see how this thing works because uh, I'm still learning it myself. But yeah, as I get older, I realize a little shaky in my hands. Especially with a cell phone. It's a little harder to hold steady with a cell phone than it is with uh, my regular camera that I used to have. Yeah, I guess time will tell how much I really like this gimbal. I think it'll work a lot better in the summertime. Maybe I'm more comfortable with it. Right now, it's just kind of weird. I don't have it hooked into my phone Wi-Fi. And I know that I can do that, and I can use all the controls on this. But uh, anyway, first time ever using a gimbal. This is a Vivitar. Picked it up at Walmart. Yeah, I know, Walmart. But you don't really... Have I don't really have a lot of choices of places to shop, especially for electronics other than Walmart, unfortunately. And I really don't like ordering stuff online and working with it like that. So there's that. I don't know if this necessarily cuts down on the uh, shaking or wobbling on my hand. Why does this thing keep turning? It keeps turning away from the... All right. Excuse me why I have technical difficulties. I swear this, it just keeps panning to the left. I have it dead center of my screen, but... It is. <laughs> I see that White House right there. And slowly but surely, this thing is going left. Yeah, trial and error. There's the next window. Well, I mean, I guess this can be my re review of this Vivitar model that, uh, Apparently, it just wants to keep going left. All right, it's a fail. Return. I know what you're thinking right now, and well, what I'm thinking is, why is there a stop sign here? I think I'm good, don't you? Yeah, over the past few years, over a few different videos, where I'm standing right now would be in question because apparently, and according to certain employees of the railroad, they claim to own the road I'm standing on. But 
as you just saw from the stop signs on either side, I find that uh, unacceptable. Can't be real. I don't feel that the county would maintain a road they don't own, nor would they put stop signs on one. Anyway, I thought it'd be nicer to walk up here to get the shot of them coming across. Rather than you having a stop sign in your shot. Anyway, they've got cars tucked all over the place in the UP. On side rails everywhere. Waiting to be used. A lot of uh, railroads pay them to store these cars. And when they need them, they order them. A lot of the grain cars you see coming out now are probably going down to uh, Okano Falls where they have a mill and they've been shipping out a lot of grain heading south. Now when those cars come back empty and they're no longer in use, they'll haul them back north and tuck them into storage until next year, until they're needed again. But a lot of the tracks in the UP of Michigan are specifically for storage. Well, that was pretty cool. Just watched all the snow fall off all the cars when he hit it. Anyway, we're going to wait the southbound train and uh, give you guys a little show. A little show, yeah, I'll give you a little show, all right. <laughs> See if anybody decides they're going to shoot across. Well, it looks like we got two engines, 502 up front. Not sure what's behind uh, 501. I don't. Uh, I don't always keep track. Oh, that's 402 back there. 502 and 402. favorite drink is Mountain Dew. I used to drink a lot of Mountain Dew and well my dentist didn't agree. No wise comments, I'll delete you. Yeah really honestly I don't uh, put up with any uh, crappy comments. Anyway you see there they uh, just ducked in here grabbed a couple more cars off a of storage line to add to their order. Taking these south with the rest of them. Weird they got two engines. My guess is they're gonna meet another train. Or just moving power. It is weird though, they brought, uh, oh yeah, 402 yesterday all by itself. Freddy's gone. Fred is gone. Anyway. Hopefully we'll get another uh, train later on for you guys. Make sure to hit the thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, hit the share button, and make a comment below. And I know what you're thinking. My hair and my beard look great, right? <laughs> no, I know what you're thinking. I should be following this train and getting some more video, but with the ice storm last night and the conditions of the roads in Northern Wisconsin and the UP of Michigan, I choose not to. Hope you respect that. Have a great day, everybody.